welcome to another video so in this video I'm going to show how to get this new man reporter HTML extra and use it so what this um, package does is uh, it takes the uh, postman collection that you have made and all the test cases that you have put in there uh, it gives a particular uh, UI to that postman collection as you can see in this uh, example that they have shown so uh, let's uh, first install node and other dependencies uh, to get this running so first of all we would be needing node so you can use this command sudo apt install node.js and give the password so it is already installed on my system else uh, it will uh, take some data and it will install on your system as well so after that uh, you would be needing once the node is there on your system then you can uh, use the node package manager uh, to install other packages so first of all we would be installing the new man package so npm install minus g new man so it will install uh, on your system if it doesn't uh, uh, if it's asking for uh, root permission you can always add sudo in uh, front of npm as you can see uh, we got some errors so let's try with the sudo So as you can see, uh, now you have that package. We are going to use new man reporter HTML extra. So we are going to install that with the sudo command. So uh, there are some fixes if you want to do, you can always use this npm audit fix if you feel like some vulnerabilities and all those things so let's clear this uh, so we got both uh, the packages now what we need to do is uh, go to our postman and uh, I have uh, created one um, one collection uh, for the COVID-19 application so uh, this actually uses all the publicly available uh, library um, and to show you um, I have used this library um, I will uh, leave the link in the description if you want to check this library out um, the it is available on github and uh, it's very simple uh, they have provided the base path and they have uh, given the whole uh, uh, endpoint name and the example response that you would be obtaining from it so they have uh, multiple endpoints so I have taken those three and uh, have <coughs> created a collection out of those so once this collection is there you can export this collection so once that's done once you have exported it so here you can see uh, this is our uh, postman collection so you would be uh, needing the name of this file so you can just copy the whole name and now you can open the terminal from here so once you have imported the post uh, exported the postman collection uh, then you need to uh, open the terminal go to this particular path and then you can uh, put in this command that is new man run uh, name of the postman collection minus r and html extra so uh, this uh, the last dependencies uh, package that we installed uh, it would be using that so after that uh, it will see like there are three requests and uh, it will show the progress as well so once that's done uh, you can see uh, it creates a folder uh, 
in uh, by the name new map um, so here in this report you will find all the details regarding that particular uh, postman collection so as you can see uh, there were three endpoints or three requests made and uh, all of the three passed and uh, zero fail so you can uh, check each uh, request individually so clicking on this uh, you will see uh, what was the request the url uh, the response time and code everything uh, even the headers request and response and the response uh, body itself so uh, i have uh, put only uh, test information for uh, like the status code of 200 so it will uh, check uh, the status code is 200 or not so uh, you can uh, always put uh, many other test uh, scenarios for uh, any particular endpoint so similarly you can see um, there are other endpoints as well scenarios out of which uh, four uh, requests made out of which one failed so you can uh, check the details here so uh, we got 403 forbidden status code and uh, what was the response of it and why it failed uh, because the status code was uh, 200 check was failed so here you can see um, it was expected the response to have the status code 200 but it got 403 so that's how you can check uh, you can directly come to this field one and uh, check what uh, failed exactly so uh, this was all about uh, Newman's um, this report generation. Uh, if you like this video, uh, give it uh, give it a thumbs up and uh, subscribe to my channel for more such videos. Thanks for watching.